Welcome back, my name is Lucas, and in this video I'm going to go over a couple of recent sales, and in there are a couple of really awesome garage sale flips. So if you wouldn't mind, please hit the like button and the subscribe, and you can stay up to date with what we're doing over here, which I'm not really sure what we're doing. But Alright, the first item here is this old school 1992 George Jones honky tonk myself to death concert tee and I paid 50 cents for this bad boy and it sold for $40 plus $8 shipping which left me with a profit of $37.95 so almost $38 so this pretty much paid for all of my garage selling that day so I guess look out for old country um, concert tees while you're out there. Next item, which was another excellent pick, uh, this Sony PlayStation 2 controller that was still sealed in the box. It was only $5 and it sold for $75 plus $8 shipping, which left me with a profit of $57.62. I did have to pay like $11 for shipping because this was going like halfway around the country, but for $5 into a $57 profit, I'll take that every day. Um, this garage sale was a little bit awkward because there was like a billion baby clothes and there was like two guy things there so I wasn't there for any baby clothes but I found the needle in the haystack. Next item, this was not a garage sale find but this was an item that I've had for two years so just not everything is always uh, rainbows and unicorns. We, or I only sold this for $12 plus $8 shipping, which gave me a profit of $232. So when I first started, people were picking up Cole Han, it looked like. Um, but I don't know what, I guess I don't know what to look for. Apparently these took forever to sell. And finally I had to way drop the price down uh, just to get rid of them. But we didn't lose money, so that's always good. And then finally, this uh, the last item here was this Woolrich. It was a vintage camo. Uh, sure, it didn't have a size, but I estimated it as a size small. I feel like if it was a little bit bigger, it could have got a little bit more money. And it also had a hole like up in the back by the tag. So, um, and I did pay up for this. So I only made a profit of 1386, but it was still a pretty quick flip, sold within a a couple days or a week or two within listing. So, those are just uh, some recent sales, some things to look for when you're out there thrifting and drop a comment below of what you found recently and we will see you guys in the next video if you wouldn't mind again just hit the subscribe button and give it a like we'll see you later